So what's so important about the tread of a car tyre? An awful lot is the answer and can determine how you stick to the road, how much water you displace and what sort of performance the driver can enjoy. Well, this is the distinctive tread of Goodyear's latest release, the Ventura, which I've test driven this week. Being a directional tyre, you have to put them on the correct way round and reversing with directional tyres gives you the weird feeling that you're reversing over a little speed hump because they're designed to grip and to displace water going forwards. Replacing Goodyear's Eagle NCT2 performance tyre, the Ventura is set to continue the innovation that the AquaTread and EMT gave us. Goodyear's engineers stretched the development process well beyond the usual boundaries whilst working on the Ventura, and the team conceived new tools such as fluid dynamics modelling. This led to several tyre technology breakthroughs under the banner of V-Tread technology. This technology, along with using a revolutionary silica-based tread compound, assures a good stiffness distribution in the tread without sacrificing any aquaplaning resistance. And I found the Ventura to provide excellent handling characteristics with promised long tread life as well. Now that tread, specially shaped ducts in the tread pattern, they increase water dispersion like the aqua tread does, providing unprecedented resistance to aquaplaning and noise levels are also reduced from the outgoing NCT2 tyre. The Ventura, like many other tyres these days, have been designed with safety in mind as well. It has a stopping distance where promised 8% less than its predecessor. I've worked out at a speed of 30 miles an hour. That means on an average family car, that's about 7 feet. Well, it's available in 31 sizes in V and H speed ratings. Try them out, you might like them.